and welcome to a new video here on my channel. So this video is obviously one of those weird ones. <laughs> I bleached my brows as you guys saw if you follow my vlogging channel. I bleached my brows because I'm so spontaneous like that. <laughs> Ew, I'm sorry. But yes, I am a shithead and I do weird stuff when I am bored and I should not be allowed to have bleach or scissors because I'm gonna do something after this video to my hair and you want to know what it is. So if you wanna know what that secret is and also how I created this look, then just keep watching. <laughs> okay, so you might think to yourself, Evelina, did you do something drastically with your appearance without thinking about it and uh, to that yes yes i did first off i will go in with the color correcting fluid right yeah from naked naked from urban decay in the shade peach and i will apply that a little bit i barely have any bruising but just a little bit to take away that i'm holding my hat uh, I just felt like having a hat on today. Um, I just wanted to light it a little bit and then I would use a little bit underneath my eyes and right there. I am in a weed, weed mood? No, <laughs> I am not. I'm in a weird mood because I've been at home. Excuse me. Do you want to go? Yes, I will. Um, I am in a weird mood because I've been at home by myself for two days now and that's probably like the worst thing I know. So if you think that I am a bit annoying then that is why. So I am going to go in with my favorite foundation of 2017. I thought that I could maybe do a best of um, using the products like best of 2017 products um, but I just haven't got into it so maybe the next video you see uh, or maybe not actually because I have another video coming up I will use the shade Alabaster 02 and 06 vanilla also I don't know if I've said this maybe I did in a vlog but I just wanted to thank you guys for being so open-minded with every everything that I've done <laughs> these last like just weeks honestly um you guys are just so open-minded and I really like that I have that fan, fan base if you can even uh, call it that but I love that you guys that follow me are just as open-minded and nice human beings as I wish you were and you are why have I been alone the entire day? Nobody has called me or texted me or anything. And now when I'm filming, everybody's texting and trying to talk to me. Not okay. Oops, it's in my brows. It's fine. Okay, so I hear that my neighbors are watching a very loud movie at the moment. So if you hear them, I'm sorry, but I cannot do anything about it. Was this even a little bit too light for me right now? It's number six. Damn. Okay, I will go in with the e.l.f. Uh, concealer in fair because this is not fair. This is like a dark, dark shade. It's like darker than this foundation and it's in the shade fair. But it's just stupid. Um, but I'm just going to use it on some pimples and stuff. Blend it up with the same brush, and this was uh, this one is a real technique brush. I love. I think it's the buffing brush. Yeah, it is. So, what do you guys think of the no brow look? Do you guys hate it? I think it looks kind of fun, <laughs> at least for like a couple of days or maybe a week. I couldn't find my shape tape from Tarte today. So I thought why not go in with a old favorite, the uh, Urban Decay and Naked Skin in a light warm. Because this one is a bit too dark for me naturally or normally. <laughs> oh my god, it was so long ago since I used this. Okay, this is not really a highlight shade though, but I am still gonna use it a little bit on my nose because I need it. 
a little bit there, here, here, and more on this because go away. The and I'm gonna use the deluxe crease brush underneath my eyes, the same one I used for the color correction. It's in the same thing from Real Techniques. I really like these ones for cream products as well. Blend, 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 blend. Or pat, 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 pat. Next up, I'm gonna use the contour, um, cream contour from Anastasia Beverly Hills in Fawn. A little bit there. There. And there. And this is the crystal brush from uh, Neve Cosmetics, one of my favorite brands that not that many know of, except if you are like from Italy, it feels like. It's a really great brand. You should check it out. These brushes, the crystal brushes, are amazing. And then I'm going to go in with the Liquid Glow from Anastasia Beverly Hills in Perla. And I will apply these where I want to highlight. It's pretty much just a cream um, highlight. And I'm gonna pat it in with a beauty sponge from Real Techniques. One of these small ones. And then I will go in with just a tiny bit of a powder. And this one is the It Cosmetics Bye Bye Pores. I absolutely whoops, love it. Whoops! <laughs> I love this one, uh, and I'm just gonna use it in the middle of my face and also underneath my eyes a little bit. Then we will use quite a lot of bronzer, I feel. I feel like it's a bronzed look today. And I'm gonna use the Makeup Store Bronzing Powder in Amazon. It's really, really cool. It has like hints of green in it but it doesn't transfer to your skin, so <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> and I'm just gonna use that with a uh, Rogue and Rouge big powder brush. Looking good. Um, <laughs> saying to myself, okay. Then we'll use just a little bit of blush because I already feel like I'm very like bronzed, so I don't really need that much blush, but I just want some color into this look. And I'm gonna use the Anastasia Beverly Hills blush, 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 blush Trio in Pool Party. And I will use this shade called Cash. And I've been into using blush with a big powder brush. I just feel like it applies the blush a lot better than like these kinds of brushes. A lot of Anastasia Beverly Hills products in this video. I don't really know why. I just. It just happened. I like them. Um, for gl the glow, more glow, I'm using the uh, glow, the sugar glow kit from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I will go in with marshmallow. Mm -hmm. A little bit right there. On my chin. And I'm gonna use a smaller brush and use it on my nibs. And while I'm at it, I'm just gonna put a little bit in my inner corner. Okay, we are a bit closer now that we are going to do the eyes. And I'm gonna use the Matte Kajal from the Body Shop. And I'm gonna use that on my entire lid. And also underneath. And we are going to blend this out. I'm gonna go in with the matte white shade from Sugar Pill and put that on top. I want my brows to look even more bleached. I don't really know how to, but I think that I will go in with some Anastasia Beverly Hills brow gel. Maybe I can just make them more visible like that because I do have brow hair here. Okay, we'll start like that. I was thinking that I should just go in with like loads of mascara, black mascara, but I'm thinking maybe I should use red. Ooh, I think that we have to try the red. If not, I could just put black on top, right? So the mascara that I'm thinking to use is the Lash Hero Fiber Extension Mascara from The Body Shop in Montana Ruby 06. 
This one is not really the red shade that I want. It's more like a um, pinkish red, but I think that we will start with this at least and maybe we can go in with a uh, red eyeliner or something on top. And this mascara also has these fibers that I think that we will use as well just to make the lashes very, very thick. Okay, so as I said, I want it to be a more red red so I'm going to go in with the Inglot eyeliner gel gel eyeliner in 79 it's like a blood red okay, do you like this better or not maybe not actually I guess I will go in with the mascara again and for those of you that hate clumpy lashes we have different opinions when it comes to lashes I like them clumpy I think it looks Cute. And now for the lips, I am thinking we could go in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Matte Lipstick in Buff. Oh, oh no! My little piercing ball. Was this a boring lip? Okay, we'll try the lip gloss butterscotch from Anastasia on top. And if that doesn't do it, we'll do another lip, I think. Okay, so what do we think of this? Like, the lip is gorgeous, but does it suit the look? You know what? I will go in with a brush like this from uh, NYX Professional Makeup. Uh, it's the 24 brush and the matte white again. Let me use this. A little bit more to lighten. Okay, while I'm doing this, I could actually tell you guys a secret. This will be the last video you see of me with this hair. My friend actually reminded me about this uh, that I said like a few days ago, maybe a week, that I had decided not to cut my hair even though I've been wanting to do it for such a long time but I I know I was on Instagram and I was like no nah, I've decided that I should just uh, take care of it and not cut it at all but I've decided that um, I will not do that I will actually cut it let's go in with this shade from sugar pill maybe we'll suit this new shade that we have a little bit better. You might think that I went a little bit overboard with the white now, but this is not a natural look. This is a, hello, I am an alien look. <laughs> okay, so like that, we are done. Ding. <laughs> All right, so this is the finished look and I really, really like it. So as I was hinting about, I am now going to cut my own hair. Yes, my own hair. Obviously, I won't go to the hairdresser because what is the fun in that? So yeah, say goodbye to this hair. And for those of you that are super angry at me right now, it is very, very damaged. Like. Okay, you see, this is my entire like front hair. It's this length. Honestly, I just realized that my hair is cut or <laughs> burnt off like a mullet and I don't want that. And I feel like this is the time, it's a new year and I'm gonna cut. And then I'm gonna take care of it and make it long and luscious and the voluminous. So yes. Stay excited for that video because that is a video coming out after this. So yeah, that is everything for this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a like so I know that you enjoyed it. And also subscribe. <laughs> subscribe if you have not already. And uh, also click the bell because I have heard that some of you don't get my videos in your subscription boxes. And that makes me very, very sad. So if you feel like you don't get notified when I upload videos, please click the bell for notifications so you don't miss out. <laughs> so you don't miss out when I cut my hair because you want to be the first to know. Yes. 
you do. <laughs> uh, so yeah, that's it. I really hope you have an amazing day and I will see you totally in the next video. Bye.